Hi, my name is Jackie Bledsoe. I'm the author of The Seven Rings of Marriage, and I'm a speaker, and I'm also the co-host of the How We Built This and Stayed Happily Married podcast. Today's verse of the day is Psalm 73, verse 26. It's one that really hits home with me, really, really resonates with me. It reads, my flesh and my heart may fail, but God is the strength of my heart and my portion forever. Thanksgiving night, 2018, while sitting amongst my wife, our kids, family and friends, uh, my heart began to fail. I experienced what is called a Widowmaker heart attack. And by the name of it, you know that I am very, very fortunate to be here to tell the story today. Um, that night, I remember a lot of details, one of which is riding to the hospital and the ambulance and just the pain and the discomfort that I was feeling that entire night it was the longest ride ever. And I just kept thinking to myself, I was like, I don't know how much longer I can hold on. And when I got to that point where I was at that end, um, that's when I just began inside in my mind and in my heart to call out to Jesus, uh, to call out to God to be the strength of my heart, which of course he did. Maybe you haven't experienced uh, something as, as uh, life threatening or a widow maker or have a family member who's gone through something like that. Um, but Maybe there's a lot of stuff going on around your life and you just feel like you can't continue on. Maybe it feels like people are winning who shouldn't be winning while you're not winning. Maybe you're doing a lot, all the right things and you feel like, Lord, this is not working out for me and you're ready to give up. You don't know how much longer you can hang on, how much longer you can hold it, how much longer you can last. Well, I want to go back to this verse and let it do exactly what it's done for me. My flesh and my heart may fail. All things around you may f fail. Your flesh, your heart, your health, um, your finances may be failing. But God is the strength of your heart and your portion forever. So I encourage you, when you're at your wit's end, when things seem to be falling around all around you, I want you to call out to him like I did that night and allow him to be the strength of your heart and your portion forever.